Hello again, this is K-Rail. I am in my kitchen, again, Park City, Utah. And I'm super excited for two reasons. One is because I'm wearing my gorgeous, sexy Mason Got a Workshop shirt that I got in, where was I? Wilton, Connecticut, back in September with my good friends Paul Volkovinsky and Kelly Manzoni. First thing. Second thing, yesterday I got a vision. I think my mom directly sent this vision from heaven. And I saw this I don't know what you would call it, a cookie sheet. And it was full of acorn squash. And I love squash. She used to make the best acorn squash you could possibly imagine. So what did I do? I decided to go to Whole Foods and get myself some acorn squash, go beyond my comfort zone, and make some of my own, which I've never done in the history of my life. So, uh, let, me, let me flip the camera around here. Here's my acorn squash. Look at how beautiful that looks. It hasn't gone into the oven yet. The oven is preheating, actually. It just clicked and it's ready to go. Guess what, folks? Acorn squash is a nutritional powerhouse. It is high in vitamin A. It is high in vitamin C. It is high in magnesium, potassium, and fiber. And I'm guessing it is alkaline too. And I had a talk with my friend Mark today about alkalinity. And alkalinity is very important for the body. Because in an alkaline environment, disease fails to exist. So don't you think it's a good idea to get more alkaline food in your body? The answer is yes. So everybody, at the same time, we're going to shake our head up and down. Ready? Here we go. Yes. Alkalinity is important, K-Rail. Good, I'm glad we're all in agreement. Hi everybody, by the way, whoever wa whoever's watching me live. Anyway, I'm super stoked about this acorn squash and I'd like to thank my mom for sending me the signal from heaven or wherever she's from around me because I decided to go beyond my comfort zone and make something like this. And I'm super stoked to bake this stuff up and have some later. I will let you know how it is. If any of y'all want any tips on your diet or fasting or food or fitness or the whole combination, what's up, Jared? Shoot me an email or shoot me a text or whatever. If you have my contact info, that's cool. You know how to find me. Last words of the day, I am about 24 hours removed from my 48 hour fast and I never had more energy in my life than I did today. My workout this morning, I had so much energy, it was unbelievable and I just could feel my muscles swelling. Look at that. 48 hours fasted right there. That's a 48 hour fasted arm. I'm feeling amazing right now still. Energy levels are through the roof. I slept like a rock last night. I woke up Zero pain, lots of flexibility. I crushed it in my workout this morning. Big shout out to anybody who came to my six pack class this morning live up at Silver Mountain Sports Club and Spa. And for all the rest of you, go to restoreyourfitness.com and get my six pack challenge, which you can do at home and join the fun. Who is that? Hey, Butch, how's it going, man? Good to see you. Anyway, I got to roll because I got to throw my squash in the oven. It's going to be ready in about an hour or so. Anybody wants to come by and sample some, please don't come by tonight because I'm chilling out watching football. But hit me up. And I would love to make some squash with you sometime. And if any of you want to work out and you're in town visiting, some of you should come visit me up here in the mountains of Park City because it's absolutely gorgeous. But then again, if you come visit, you may not want to leave because it is so beautiful here. But come out and visit. Let's work out together. Let's go for a hike and let's hang out. Till next time, this is K-Rail. Keep it real. Honor your body. Honor your diet. And honor your neighbor. And don't forget to pick up at least one piece of trash a day. Later.